Hello, welcome back to Dark Fall Lights Out. We have explored um, this room in the last video. That was the last thing we did. Matiyo, I'm butchering her name, Tiku. So we got out of there. We can't go into this room for whatever reason. Maria Ortega it says it's open, but it won't let us in. So let's go on down and look at some of these other rooms. We have Ivan crossed. Let's go see. It's his birthday. Oh, and he's got this cool little robot thing that we're supposed to be able to do something with, but I guess not just yet. Well, that just goes back to the robot. His birthday cards. My dear son Ivan, we're all thinking about you down there under the sea. Mom, Alex, and Dad. P.S. We found the robot you wanted, but don't you think you're getting a little old for these things? Wonder why he wanted the robot. Ivan, what happened to your time off? Those Dios people are treating you like a robot. Haha. -ha. Anyway, my sweet, I've included some photos of me. Sorry about the poor quality. Hopefully they should keep you company down there in the depths of the sea. How did that last launch go? Can I expect to see your face on the CNM News broadcast? Tony XX. Dolphin. So we're under the ocean, but I thought this was a deep exploration. Deep, deep, oh, um, uh, space exploration. A present, nice. Yeah, we're under the sea. Okay. I don't know. Sci-fi fan. Interesting. And what is this? A remote control for the robot? Okay. Okay, I am inserting this one here out of sequence only because I forgot to go back and do this, but I had done it. So that's why I knew what that last symbol was, but um, we're going to do it now. We saw that bunch of colors in the um, tent in the present time or whatever and so um, we're going to do that on the remote so we get pink green red blue orange and he turns his head and there's our last our symbol our pink symbol that we needed so in case everybody wondered how I got that that's how it came. So it's kind of out of sequence, but there you go. Pictures of his girlfriend, and I have no idea what that is a picture of. Nothing else for us to play with. Interesting. Oh, well, that's nice. A calm sea is never empty. Yeah, you want a horror story about being under the water, deep in this ocean, when you're deep in the ocean. I don't think I would. Okay, let's go check on Vimaldivia. See what he's got going on. Okay, he likes Egyptian things or archaeology. Level Hall, Oxfordshire. Okay, can't click on any of that. Those are like horseshoes or arches or. What is this? Sites of the Ancient World Illustration 534, Ancient Fetch Rock, Cornwall. Of all the periods of the ancient world, it is the Bronze Age that most fascinates historians. We know so little about the tribes of that time, circa 2000 BC. Although their settlements and ceremonial sites dot the countryside from the islands off Scotland to the far north to Fetch Rock, 12 miles off the coast of southwest England. So he's been doing a little research into the past of this place, which seems to be what he enjoys. Stuff down here that we don't get to look at. And his bathroom. These 
rooms. I don't know if I'd like that. My bathroom is like right out in the open. You just don't have any room for nothing. Okay, we looked at Ivan, didn't we? Pretty sure we did. He, that's whose birthday it is. That's right. Let's see. Magnus has been removed. All right. He's probably the one that was in the um, medical bay. Corbin, what are you doing, Corbin? Got a spaceship there. Got children. Your MP3. Hello, Dad. Oh. Papa's letter sent you a message. We have been playing in the garden. There is a rabbit that comes to eat Mum's plants. She gets very cross with it. Josh, we are supposed to be talking. as inadequate. Well, there's little I can do about that. As project manager, I have sole access to the main system and the only key, and I'm not letting anyone near it. 
until the full investigation is over. I refuse to be held responsible for the loss of 10 million pounds worth of hardware. Hatton Industries are laying laying for blood? Something like that. That probe show dangerous signs of independence before loss of contact. What shut down the keeper's safeguards? What was the unknown matter it encountered? I feel devastated for Malachi. I spent many months training and programming the little guy and really miss him. The weeks of supporting him through the simulations haunt my thoughts. I wonder what dead end of space he is trapped in. I guess my close relationship to the probe comes from my security clearance. I'm the only one who knows the initiation sequence, as well as Malachi himself, of course. But with no power and backup, he's alone out there. If he had made the jump, there was always the possibility that he could have used the matter manifestation software to generate power from virtually anything. I shouldn't think on these things, as he didn't make it back. He vanished from the scanners, and contact was lost almost immediately. I guess I should destroy the codes and initiation sequence. No need for them now. So straight down the toilet they go. Goodbye, Malachi. I'm sorry I failed you. Interesting. What is this? Corbin, the children are worrying me. It began a week ago. Morgan started having disturbing dreams. The imagery she describes is frightening. Then a few nights ago, Miles began having nightmares. He describes you as being chased through darkening corridors, corridors underneath the lighthouse. There's no lighthouse on SEO 37, is there? I sought some advice from Dr. Romana, who suggested a dream journal. I've gathered a few of the images together and will have a courier deliver them to the DEO's main depot. Hopefully, you should have them by the 29th, as well as some recent holiday snaps. I'll also include a new voice message from the kids. I'm sure it will bring a little light to your underwater world. I wish you'd invest in a new player. That antique you have is so useless. I know you like all that retro stuff, but it isn't very practical, is it? I might include a few of this week's tracks from the music charts. I miss you, your loving wife, Samantha. Okay. So his kids are dreaming about what's going on here. Oh, we can't get into him. Oh, the party. Party, party. Okay. A little sake. Some kind of soup. I guess they're having Chinese. Some glasses. We need something we can get a fingerprint off of. Birthday, ooh, close up of his eyes. Happy birthday, Ivan. What have we got here? Data log from Taku, Taku. The party, forget the cooking, a handy delete function means I can use this data pad as a notepad and record the actions of the other crew while it looks like I am cooking. Magnus is switchy and unpredictable. There is an atmosphere that doesn't lend itself to a birthday party. Poor Ivan, I think he feels that's his fault. This wasn't helped by Vimal. It seems he too thinks that Magnus is losing it, but lacks subtlety in his questioning. I really don't think that I... Th think being down here is affecting your sanity is the best thing to say to a possible psychotic. A uh, man who wasn't there. Magnus is staring at me. I'm pretending to read the cookery notes, but he knows I'm sure of it. There's something about him, something evil. What am I saying? Evil? He's just sick. The others are afraid of him. He's mumbling. It sounds like a song. No, it's a poem. As I was going up the stair, I met a man who wasn't there. I just need that print. I know it's him. Proof. I've got them. A complete set of prints. The other crew took an age to get out of the room, but I was alone in the end. At least I thought I was alone. I couldn't help feel someone was watching me. I caught a glimpse of someone reflected in the refrigerator. 
It looked like Magnus, but there was something else. He seemed to glow, like the thing I saw outside my room. Some kind of high-vis gear. No, it was all over. It was his skin. I'm going to get back to my cabin, pour myself a stiff one, and run these prints. At least the answer is so close. Okay. Well, I bet there's prints on there, but we just can't get them because we need something else. Wait, was that something else? What was that? Nope, that's just, what's this? Oh, just a, but a wheel. Sometimes the things that has you look at are so random. What is this? Okay. Huh. Okay, so nothing else here. So, we must have missed something in one of the rooms so that we could get the prints. Oh, fortune cookies. A treat awaits in the form of bags. Seek Malachi. He knows all. The secret of success is to know something nobody else knows. Okay. Okay. So... successfully dematerialized at 0700 11 235. The probe was equipped with high-res scanning equipment and particle examination software. After collecting essential and useful data, I'm going to let you guys read that because I'm not sure how important that really is. Byron. So this was the second. So they have different versions of different probes. This one's Juan Luez. So they're playing with AI in the probes. Interesting. And there's Malachi. That's the one we need. Launched at, and the text is missing, of course, because we needed that. Okay. I always forget where exactly it is I can turn around. Okay, what's down here? Is this the medical? Okay, I know there has to be something in here. We've explored in here before. But it just seems like there has to be.
have to keep going back and restarting and interesting. But I think we've looked at all of this. from Ortega that's the sick bay we don't want to go there I'm pretty sure that came from in Otaku in here on her notes didn't it I'll find the culprit and work it out There it was. Oh, okay, we'll go back to it. Just so I can point it out. 391865. Okay. So, yeah. So, now we've got that. Let's go get our... I wonder if with that we can see the... Because um, I know we're supposed to see something in with that. Where the guy's laying in the sick bay. Also, we'll shine that. There it is, our fingerprint. And now we have a fingerprint of it. What does this want me to do? That's weird. Oh, it probably just wanted me to do that. Okay, which we did. All right. I want to go back to this. Whoops. Where are we going? I want to go back to the sick bay too. And see if we can't um, use this light. Yeah, this is where we're going. I meant to go in. There we go. So that we can see what the fingerprint's going to show us. Well, she already told us what it showed. Is that it matches.
that's the match, right? Oh, there we go. Oh, you understand me. You haven't have tried. The primitives. The primitives. The Drake. The Drake. The Drake. The Agnes creature, the white creature, all have tried and all have failed. All are useless to my cause. None can understand. But then there is you, man. Then there is you, digging in the dark. Pieces exist together. Why do you struggle? Why do you care? Why do you care? Death is a short while for you. Death is a short Death while is for you, my Paul. Death is everywhere. Ooh. Okay. So, Magnus got involved with Malachi, which we now know is the probe, and it didn't turn out good for him. Oh. We need to get in there. Who was the only one with the key? Was that Ivan? No, you're Vimal. You're Ivan. You're the only one with the key? We miss it. Now, go then. Another. Hmm. Oh, look, it's two ni twenty ninety. We've got a year now. that have to do with you and the remote? Well, if you're the only one with the key, where did you hide your key? found something in new oh that's where we found the remote huh it was under there and there was no key through here okay so he's not the only one with the key did you have a key and we just didn't look far enough Somebody's got a key to let us into that room. We just have to find out where it is and who it is. Oh, you know what? with was it you I bet it was you okay there's the car aha okay was that this way that's the sick bay, but let's still go check that out. Because we have our light now. See if it'll let us use our light. Oh, he's gone. Uh-oh. Oh, there's our date. I think 
think when I was playing with it, yeah, I think when I was playing with it, it didn't, um, you didn't put in the time separately, you just needed the year, or the date, or something, I don't know, was it in here, no, this makes it hard to know where you're going, Yeah, it was in here. Okay, now we can use our key. Aha! Oh, there's the time. Oh, 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 five. Cool. Okay. Corbin Hart. Oh, he had the launch thing. I thought it was Ivan. I get so confused. Okay, launch sequence executed. Initiate transmit. Okay, it's all up to Malachi now. Fingers crossed, people awaiting confirmation. Yes, we have confirmation. People crack open that champagne. Confirmation agreed. Sending. We've got a request to activate the Keeper software. Sending confirmation. Go for it, Malachi. We are looking forward to hearing from you, buddy. Hello, Deals. Good to hear you. How are you getting up on up there? I'm glad to be here, Corbin. I'm going to leave you to it for now. You have the instructions. Go find us some dark matter and send us a postcard from deep space. Ready for secondary jump. Deals activating. See you soon, buddy. Have fun. wonder what the dark matter is. Anyway... Switching to automatic mapping. Good night, Dios. Good night, Malachi. Go drift among the stars. Dios, please advise. Keep your software at 16%. System resources dangerously low. Unknown event has damaged Keeper software. Emergency return initiated. Checking location and return coordinates. Hey, Malachi, what's going on up there? Initiate temporary shutdown. Malachi, initiate temporary shutdown now. Malachi, shut down now. Just silence from Malachi. Cannot comply. Initiating return journey. Preparing to make transmat jump. Malachi, this is direct order. Shut down all systems. Do not make a transmat jump, please. I am coming home. Malachi, if your systems are damaged, the jump could be a disaster. Shut down all systems. We will get you back. I promise. Now please go to sleep. As I was going up the stair, I met a man who wasn't there. Malachi, what have you done? Silence. Goodbye, my friend, wherever you may be. So they lost Malachi. He landed in the... Um, in the... What is that? Lighthouse. And that's what started all of our troubles. I wanted to go down here and check out something. Hmm. Okay. I thought maybe that card would take us back, but it seems we have to go the long way. Unless it's in Corbin's spot. No. Guess not. Okay, we'll have to go all the way back the hard way. Oh, that 
gets to the... That's the way out. Okay. Oh, now I gotta get through this. See, I'm, I just, I'm so directional. Finally! All this beeping. See, I never figured out what's beeping there that attracts my attention. But, okay. Let's just go. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go back to here. here. Just let us out of here. We're done with this one. Okay, so we've got the date. We've got three of the um, shapes. The two X and Z coordinates. No, we're not going back in there. go next is I think we've got everything from that ancient spot that's just where we need to go for the um, you know where I'm going to go we're in the past one huh yeah so we got that one. That was one of our coordinates. We're going to go up here. There we go. Okay, there's our fourth shape. It's a weird shape, and but it's yellow. So now we just need a coordinate. And I think I know where to go to get the coordinate. We need our Y coordinate. to go I don't want that we need to go back to whatever it was 20 or 1980 whatever it was 20 whatever 2004 whatever year that more more modern year is I have no idea why it has me do a light there that's just weird. So this is probably not the most linear way to do this, but you know what? It's the way we're doing it. Because I hunted and hunted and hunted. I was like, there's something I am missing. So when I wasn't recording, I kind of wandered around a bit and found... Oh, 
some of these things. Okay, through here. go here. Oh, you know what? We do. I forgot about this. We're going to have to go back and look at the robot. Because we never did the robot thing. Okay, that's those. This one. Look at those colors. Okay. So it's pink green, red, blue, orange, on the remote, pink, green, red, blue, orange, yeah, because see there's the remote right there, just like our remote, okay, so we're going to have to go back to the robot and look at him. I'm thinking that's the picture that was on the postcard, but it's not helping me out here. But before we go back and do that, there's something else we want to do. Finally learning my way around here. And then we're going to have everything we need to go get Malachi. Five, five, six, four, right? Yeah. Right down here. We have that thing. Okay, five, so now we're going to go up here, and what I was doing wrong before was I was going all the way here. to the top, over here, over here, look closer, look closer. not realizing here. that here. we don't want to go all the way to the top. Because, yeah, I was climbing this ladder all the way up. Like here. And then I couldn't get off and see anything. But I could see there was stuff to be seen. But see, the floors down there is what it's showing me, and I didn't understand it. So if I go down one more, now I can get off. And we're going to peek through. And there's four... So we have L, whatever, one, three, four, five, six. But we don't have two. The lighthouse. And the pictures. for what it's worth. And then we have this thing. And this is what, because I kept thinking these have got to be used for something. So, this is one. We don't know what two is, but this is three. And this is four. So that's got to be two. So one, two, three, four. Cool. 
Ah, see, I knew we had to get that dial. And it looks like it has to go like that. Okay. So let's go back. Yeah, see, that was sneaky. I thought. To make you not go up all the way. I mean, it kept making me look down, but I was like, why is it making me look down? What am I looking at? It wasn't very clear. We're not going to do any of those because we've done them already. Okay, let's go to that little... I've wandered around this island so much. I've pretty much got it memorized. Finally. Okay, back in here. And we're gonna play with the radio. Which I knew we needed to do. Okay, so this one's supposed to point at one. This one's supposed to point at C. And this is Y. And there it is. 120, 180, 20. Okay. So now we're going to go back. We've got to go back to the old. If I can remember the easy way to do that. I think it was in one of the pictures. Oh, you know what? We can do it in the, um, where the generator is. Go back to the old lighthouse. Right there. That'll take us back to the old lighthouse. Whoops, I didn't. Okay, back in the old lighthouse. Up to the top, not the top, but um, Drake's room. So we can go to the past. One, two. Codes memorized. Right. E. Three. Or was it three seven? Eight. Four. There we go. cave part. Did I see through there? Did I take a wrong turn? There it is. So we can get down to Malachi. There he is, Malachi. We know what the sequence is now, so that's the date. X is 160, 140, 90. Y is 120, 180, and 20. 
180, 110, 150. Okay, now these need to be in the order of the colors that we saw early on. Purple, green, yellow, blue. So, um, the first shape is you. Is it actually pink? What other choices do we have? Green. So it's pink. Okay. Pink. And the next one is you in green. And the next one is that last one we found in yellow. And the last one is what looks like a sun with rays in blue. There we go. My time is soon I will be with my kind. Won't be here to cause all the trouble. You have saved me, Madman, and all time is yours. All right. Because that was so far back, the lighthouse workers survived. Nobody got killed. It was all good, and I don't know. Your time. Thank you. A game is nothing without players. Though three men dwell upon the island to keep the lamp alight. As we steered under the lee, we caught no glimmer in the night. A passing ship at dawn had brought the news, and quickly we set sail to find out what strange thing might ail the keepers of the deep sea light. We found no sign in any place, and soon again stood face to face before the gaping door, and stole into the room once more as frightened children steal. I though we hunted high and low, and hunted everywhere, of the three men's fate we found no trace of any kind in any place, but a door ajar, and an untouched meal, and an overtoppled chair. We 
seemed to stand for an endless while, though still no word was said. Three men alive upon the aisle, who thought of the three men dead. And that was Dark Fall Lights Out. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. Um, it's kind of a, a, a the point and clicks get confusing for me anyway at least where I'm going um, it was kind of hard to find some of the clues but we got through it we did it and now we saved the men at the lighthouse so successful I would say um, so yeah leave a like and please do subscribe um, it's free for you and it totally helps me out and I will see you back in many, many more adventures. Bye-bye for now.